if I stop being busy, I'll start freaking out and pacing. I've done that for a whole day, like when I have a show coming up. Literally, it just turns into this weird aviator kind of thing where I'm like <laughs> biting my fingernails and storing my urine in jars. <laughs> Some would say this is too much day. I think it's just right. It's... I can't believe you're wearing that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That's one outfit? way to compliment an outfit. <laughs> when you first asked me if I liked it, I said, I like this and this, or I like this and this, but I'm not sure about this, this, and this. Ah, uh, okay. That's a lot yeah. of this is. <laughs> But here's the thing about Tom Petty. Tom Petty died doing the thing he loved. That's what we all have to remember. Drugs. I'm talking about drugs. <laughs> he died doing drugs. You guys are a lot of fun. Sycamore Tavern, I've been here several times. This place is great. Trevor's a great host, like a great owner. I don't know what he does, but he seems to be in charge. <laughs> we have an incredibly stacked lineup. Put your hands together right now for the legend, Brody Stevens. <laughs> Thank you. It is an honor to meet your heroes, uh, especially when they look like a hipster fucked a chimney sweep. <laughs> it's amazing! <laughs> <laughs> too soon, too soon in my comedy career. We have a good notice, and it's fun. I love it. And enjoy it. The Tony Robbins of comedy. We need more of that. Let's walk on hot coals. Let's do it. <laughs> Brian Redman, <laughs> Lee Sayan, Andy Letterman, Kurt Metzger. Cry, dude! Real talk, my mom is uh, bipolar. She would always have her sweet moments, like she told me like I was cute all the time. She's like, Ryan, you're so cute. You're the most handsome boy in her school. <laughs> But I didn't believe her, I just thought that was like a mom script. Until one night, she was in a fit of intense bipolar fury, screaming to me about my grades. She yelled, Ryan! You can't go through life just by being handsome! <laughs> and at that moment, I thought to myself, Oh my god, she really does think I'm cute. <laughs> We're at the tail end of the show, this is almost over. The next person coming to the stage is a great man. His name is Willie! I live like a bunch of homeless people. They're called a band. I just found out. You know, that's what homeless people identify as uh, in groups. They're a band. There's a band member by my uh, by my exit. I uh, one week I gave him a dollar, and then uh, the next week I gave him a dollar. The third week he wasn't there anymore. I was like, I did it. <laughs> it's gonna be it for me tonight. So. That's what I love about stand-up, is you can be totally be present and break and react to shit, as opposed to improv yes. or or character work, where yeah. if you break, Round sure, it could be funny, but you're not supposed to. You're Bye, to Bye. Bye. See ya. Wait, wait. <laughs> it's Luke. Is it the vlog? Luke, <laughs> coming, dude. Appreciate it. Killed it out there. He's fucking melting my face. I just fucking love you, Devin. Oliver, get in here, you son of a bitch. I love you, Luke. Right. Luke Pacheco I at, at you Pacheco Yourself. Pacheco <laughs> I knew comedy was a thing, but I didn't know there was this path to it. That's why I hang out so much at comedy clubs. I just hang I've out. noticed that, just yeah. Stand there. <laughs> the comedy store, just like... Yeah. And then over time, you can smart. organically make friendships. You know, control yourself, but also, I don't know, meet these people, have a fun time, like, be a part of this, enjoy the moment. Yeah, hanging out is a huge part of comedy. <laughs> Wise words. Wise words. All right, we got it? I think we got it. I think we got it. <laughs> Thank you so much, man. I love you, I love you. I love you, Get crazy, don't end up like those guys. That's why I have you. Get yourself an Oliver. Chaos and control. Chaos, control. Team friendship. <laughs>